What's going on guys? So today we're going to be replacing the memory on this Precision 5530. So this is a Dell Precision 5530 and we'll show you guys how to replace the memory and if you wanted to replace the battery and so forth, I'll show you guys where everything is located as well. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, I already have the right uh, bit for all of these so I'll remove the covers. There's screws as you can see all visible here and then there's two more screws hidden right over here. So let's get started. Uh, the memory as you can see is right here so to remove it you just pull this away from each other and here's the memory stick and it is it's a PC4 so DDR4 and the memory that I'll be replacing is pretty much the same one so this one is this bad it went bad so I'm gonna be replacing it and to put it in is the same way it only goes in one way and you just pretty much just push it until it clicks in so simple as that you have two slots um, you have your M.2 over here is just held down by one screw and you just pull it out you also have your battery now the battery has uh, quite a few screws and each one um, is pointed so it has an arrow pointing showing you where each screw is so there's one two three four five six seven so once you remove these and you also have to disconnect the battery by pretty much just pulling this connection back and it's easier to do this once you actually get the battery out a little bit um, so once you get the battery unscrewed then you can easily uh, remove the, the connection to the battery here so make sure you also put this back correctly so this is the first thing you want to do before you go ahead and remove any other parts I only replaced the memory I'm not really too worried um, but uh, that's pretty much it as simple as that so the cover if you saw how I removed it I just pulled it back and to put it in you just push it and it will click into place and then you can put all the screws back So now that we have the memory back, we'll go ahead and put the case back. So uh, one thing I didn't notice um, mention is actually the screws under here. So these are different screws than the rest. Um, they're longer and the other ones are smaller as you can see here. So just keep that in mind. Um, so we'll go ahead and put all these screws back and we should be good to go. And I'll start with the ones over here. And what I like doing actually before putting all the screws back on is turning on the, the, the laptop, making sure it's actually working. So we'll do that first before I put everything back on. So I'm getting the, the logo there. So it's booted up, looks good. So now we can actually go ahead and turn it off or you don't have to turn it off. We'll close it and we'll put all the screws back on. And we're pretty much done afterwards. And this is the last screw so we are pretty much done guys everything is good and the laptop booted up 
and thank you guys for watching if you have any questions concerns you can go ahead and comment below if you like this video on this channel uh, subscribe share and as always see you guys next time